A group of Brock University alumni have returned to the Marilyn I. Walker School of Fine and Performing Arts, working on what some of us only dream of, a permanent vacation. The Permanent Vacation Exhibition is an alumni show here at the Marilyn I. Walker School of Fine and Performing Arts. We have six artists here that have been working together since they graduated from Brock University uh, between the years of 2014 and 16, and they all worked together um, at Rodman Hall in our 4F06 program. It's actually a very uh, interesting array of work. So we have uh, paintings, there's some video pieces, drawings, installation uh, work, and uh, we also have uh, currently one photograph. There may be more added. It could be a show that changes over time. Matt, can you tell me about your submission for the Permanent Vacation Exhibition here? Uh, yeah, I did three paintings for the show, and uh, I kind of been working on them for the past uh, few months, even before the show was kind of planned. They're kind of themed around a laborious uh, task and how they relate to real world um, action and kind of working from memory and how these images kind of are seen by me like in day to day life in like um, kind of like urban settings and like home and different colors and like different like textures and yeah I kind of want to like build up these layers and everything and like kind of showcase that. Permanent vacation is as much as a challenge as it is a slogan, encouraging artists to dedicate their everyday lives to entertaining their wildest ambitions. I think it's just a group of people who we all kind of connected in our time at Brock, and I think we all have kind of the same ideas and like we get along really well, and I think we just want to work as a group to have like our ideas pushed and kind of showcase them in ways that maybe other people aren't like considering having uh, art shows and stuff like that. And hopefully we have a lot more shows coming up. I think that's the plan. Does your work have a specific name? It's called um, Between Looking. Um, and uh, I kind of um, created it um, mimicking a sort of window. Um, I'm interested in the idea of perspective and what you can see and what you cannot see. Um, and I'm also interested, I thought it would be an interesting concept to have curtains on the side that are um, drawn by the artist's hand. So I'm in control of like what the viewer can see, what they cannot see. As the graduates expand ideas and develop new work, they each continue to recognize the value of the St. Catharines arts community and the impact it has on their practice. It's a hard world out there. It's really hard to get into, um, to stay with art and like keep working and everything. Um, so it's quite the experience. This is really um, an opportunity to, to push myself. Um, I'm very excited to be showing here. It's As a graduate of a fine arts program, I can tell you it's paramount to the continuing education and, and uh, while they're actually still at Brock, it's a space for them to explore their work, but also present it in a professional um, forum where the public meets it, um, which is a much more different relationship than the in-class uh, discussions and, and um, interactions that happen. Permanent Vacation will be on display at the Visual Arts Exhibition Space Tuesdays to Saturdays from 1 to 5 p.m. until Friday, December 1st. Reporting for The Source in St. Catharines, Michelle Cuthbert.